And you know, I catch dogs and find homes for them. Yeah. So one day, I was tracking people. I was looking for Chauncey Ryder McPherson, famous fencer from the past. Went to University of Pennsylvania, was an Olympian. And I'm checking with old people, and they, uh, somebody said Chauncey Ryder McPherson lived in a mansion in Connecticut. So I just, I asked somebody, because I didn't know how many places are rich places. Mm -hmm. And they're telling me all the rich towns in Connecticut. So I've got like 15 towns in Connecticut I'm looking at. Mm -hmm. And I find them at first. So I call up. I talk to a woman. I said, oh, hi, I'm looking for the family of Chauncey Ryder McPherson. And she goes, I'm his daughter. <laughs> I said, well, and I start talking to her. And my dog is barking at something, and her dog's barking. I go, this is, I'm sorry, my dog's barking. She goes, my dog won't stop. <laughs> I said, dogs are amazing. I said, you know, I catch dogs. She says, that's funny. She goes, oh, where are you going from? And I said, I'm from uh, L.A., Culver City. She goes, you know, it's funny, this dog is from Culver City. I said, well, how could you have a dog from Culver City? She goes, well, my daughter's an actress, and she was in this theater in this weird building. I said, no, wait a minute. What? She said, yeah, we were going to see the play, and this guy had a dog that he had found. I said, that's me. I said, you got a dog next to a theater? Was it a fencing club? She goes, it was. I said, that's me. I gave you. She goes, my daughter got the dog from you, and then she couldn't keep the dog, and we have it here at the house. I said, you got to be kidding me that you have a dog. You're Chauncey Ryder McPherson's daughter, and you've got a dog that I caught in South Central L.A. in your house barking at me on the phone. <laughs> That's just unbelievable. I said, my dog bark here caught him in Albuquerque. <laughs> Is that weird? That's wild. And she sent me all these great pictures. 